Hey, Aaron here. Uh, I was coming home from golf practice listening to the radio, Dan Patrick show. I'm a huge fan. And I'm a huge fan of Ryan Leaf. And it triggered a story that I don't think I've really told very many, if any, people. A lot of people do their, like, sober recon, um, you know, when they've been drinking. And there are certain people and things that they research. And Daniel Patterson's been that way for a lot of people. Uh, with the Sobertunity.com uh, that I'm a participant in. But this was years and years ago. I would disappear when I would isolate when I would drink. And I remember one time uh, isolating and I had disappeared and I was in a hotel and doing, I was like doing sober recon work. And, and I decided to check out the rehab center that Ryan Leaf um, founded. And I remember actually getting a person on the phone, which I was so surprised and so impressed. And I I think they could see right through the crap I was spewing on the phone that I was, in, in fact, the one that was impaired, but I was calling about my spouse, which, looking back, it was both of us. And I remember speaking with him. I still remember his name. His name was Asher, uh, and he... Uh, worked for Ryan and I remember him being on the phone with me for probably two hours just talking me through different rehab things and different things I could do and honestly keeping me safe for myself um, I'll never forget that I remember I think I followed him on Instagram even and I remember in my you know some sort of stupid drunk arrogant uh, well if Ryan will call me then I'll go to rehab and I remember the phone rang one day. It was a California number, and it was Ryan Leaf. The guy uh, drafted in the 1998 draft. He's about the same age as me. He's had a lot of the same experiences as me. But he was not above calling some random guy in Wisconsin uh, to help. I'll never forget that. And that's part of why I'm very very protective of my sobriety and why it it is absolutely important to me to continue to be sober and help other people be sober because I don't, I don't know you know you just never know with uh when you get somebody on the phone or somebody connects with you and Asher did that and Ryan Leaf um he is hall of fame people as is everybody at the DP show so uh I credit them with a lot of that Thanks.